Good evening, guys. Our latest will be about President Ramaphosa Julius Malima and Arthur Fraser. Let's follow up on that. As we have already heard, Arthur Fraser, former Correctional Services boss, opened a case against Mr. President. Fraser alleges that Ramaphosa concealed a 4 million robbery at his Limpopo game farm and he opened a case of corruption, money laundering and kidnapping against him. According to Fraser's statement, $4 million was stolen from Ramaphosa's farm but was later recovered. Fraser alleges that Ramaphosa concealed that robbery from SAPS and paid bribes to silence the suspects. In his statement, Fraser went on to say the suspects were beaten and interrogated at Palapala Farm in 2020, Feb 2020. However, that money they were accused of stealing was later found. This Palapala Farm is owned by Ramaphosa. Responding to this allegation, Malema said he has files and he is ready to expose Mr. President. Here was his tweet. Malema said if all goes well, we'll upload Ramaphosa's buckleary videos on the EFF website tomorrow after our court appearance. Based on what Malema said, it means uh, some of the information relating to this matter was leaked to him. But some people said he must focus on VPS and leave this matter to the authorities and the president. Office of the Presidency issued a statement responding to these allegations and they deny any wrongdoing. If these uh, claims are true and Ramaphosa could be arrested, he, this would then mean ANC step aside policy will kick in and he won't be able to contest for the presidency in December when ANC calls for its uh, elective conference. In November 2020, there was this article which was alleging that there is illegal hunting, animal hunting in Ramaphosa's farm and people are now saying it means this article was correct. Hectic stuff. That will be all from my side. Please remember to leave your comments down below and let us know of your take regarding what we've covered. That will be all from me. Thank you so, so much for tuning in. I'll see you again in the next update. Bye.